y'all. I'm so glad you're here. Hello. I'm Vonda. This is Paula. And we're Scripture DIY. Yep. And we just decided we were just going to sit down and do a craft this afternoon. Yes. So we are so glad you've joined us. We, yes, we have been visiting the Dollar Tree and we picked up a few cute things. And so we're just going to stuff it. That's what we're going to do. <laughs> we're going to take the stuff we made and we're going to stuff it. It's so much fun. There you go. <laughs> now, if you are a master crafter, we hope to get your brains going in the direction towards crafting. Yes. It's almost Christmas. We need to get yes. busy and get the Christmas things going. If you're not a crafter, or you think you're not a crafter. Yes, you are. You're wrong. <laughs> we hope to show you that it doesn't take a brain surgeon <laughs> to nope. craft. It doesn't take a lot of money to craft. No. Nope. You just sit back and watch and just get going, because here we go. Yes. Now, we bought a... Um, placemat from the Dollar Tree. Yes, they have some really cute ones, y'all. Look at this. So it's got uh, holly on one side, solid red silky mm -hmm. stuff. On, you like that already? Good. Right. So silky stuff on the inside. But when you pick up a placemat, look at it and make sure that it's two separate pieces of material right. sewn together. That you can do this too. That you can pull apart. Yes. Because that's what we're going to do. Yes. First thing, Paula is going to take the seam out of the whole end of it. Yes. Take take the one that has the tag. It's not yeah. going to take a whole no. lot to that just tag off. open that. Rip it off. You're so violent today. <laughs> <laughs> I feel for my life. <laughs> I don't know if I want her to pick up a pair of scissors or not. Here we go. <laughs> Good. So. She's just going to take that seam out yes. um, because we um, also have picked up, not at the Dollar Tree, but in a box that I had from last year, um, some material ribbon. Now yeah. this is... It's really pretty. Very pretty. It. Um, I was hoping it would tell me what it's made out of, but it's so old it doesn't say anymore. But it is mm -hmm. like a stiff ribbon. Mm -hmm. It's got the holly just like on the back side of the placemat. Um, we tried several different ribbons. We tried one that had a wire or two wires on either side that was so cute, but it just didn't work. It didn't work very good. If yeah. you're going to do a pillow, it needs to be a soft, yeah, a non wired ribbon. Non wired. Yeah. Who needs to be wired? We don't need to be <laughs> wired. We need no. unwired. Yes. And just this cute little ribbon. Yeah. Now, it's probably an inch and a half maybe wide. You yeah. can do pretty much any width that you want to. I just like this because it looks like the underside of the pillow. Yeah, it really matched the other, the decorated side yeah. of the pillow. Okay. Holly with red beads. Holly, yeah. holly beads and leaves. Yeah. Just like that. Now, we're going to get a pillow um, and stuff in there, and when you put a pillow in there, you have to kind of wiggle it, tug it, mm -hmm. get it all in there just like you want it, or you can buy the fill stuff and right. just put the filling in there. But who doesn't have a bunch of pillows around that you don't either are yucky now, or you don't like them anymore, or you just are ready to change them out? Yeah. So, I mean, we all have those. Yeah. Yeah. So... Now, on this seam, while she's doing this, let me tell you while I'm thinking about it, don't pull the material. Right. Because you're going to be stretch it out. Yeah. Um, this so is a careful. nylon, silky feeling. Yeah. And it will stretch. So be very so careful. So just go careful through there. Just kind of stick your scissors in there, and it should just yeah. pull right on through that. Yeah. Um, don't stretch it. Don't be hard with it. Be, be very gentle. gentle. Be gentle. <laughs> That's right. So okay, taken. so while she's doing that, let's do scripture. Yeah, Vonda has a new, a awesome scripture. The let's Lord do has scripture. Heard. Really good. One. Okay, hold on, it went crazy. Okay, I highlighted it, but it went, went it went away. It did. It was verse six. Verse six. Okay, we'll yeah. find six. First Go ahead Samuel. and undo your thing. Yeah. First Samuel twenty five six, 
And yes. thus you shall say to him who lives in prosperity, Peace be to you, peace to your house, and peace to all that you have. Peace. You get peace through Jesus. Yeah. You get peace knowing that you are being taken care of and that there is nothing too hard for him. Right, Pamela? Nothing is too wrong, too hard for Jesus. And once you get that peace in your heart, the peace that passes all understanding, yeah. then um, there you go for Christmas. And we are dying here. Can you hand me that? Um, this thing right here? No, the pink cord so oh. that I can charge my phone. Yes. Excuse me just a second, y'all. It always, I always charge it. But today, I just had a different mind here. That's okay. And I didn't Gotta think about it. We have That's the charger right. right there. We're not stressed. No. No. Okay, there we go. Let yeah. me look on the back side. Let's make sure that it's in there good. She's checking the connection. And I think it is. We've got a good connection, y'all. There you We're go. We're not going to oh, die. You're not leaving us yet. God's got us covered. Okay, so that's um, that was our scripture for today. I hope that you think about that and you think about the peace in your life. That's right. And through this year, especially Christmas and this crazy year, yes. we really need to concentrate on what is important in our lives. Yep. What we do have, not what we don't have. Yes, be thankful and for what you've got. That's right. And let us just absorb that peace that we get from knowing that we are taken care of. Yes. Um, we are his children, and so he's going to take care of us. Yes. Now, she's going to fold this right in half mm -hmm. so that she gets an idea of where the middle of this is. Y'all can't even see that. What do you Sorry. think about here? <laughs> Okay. So we're gonna fold, fold it, it and find this and cut this off right here. Right. And we're gonna and we're gonna open it up in the middle. Look at there. There Does we that go. Help? That's better. There we yeah, go. Yeah, you can see what my hands are doing. So we're gonna fold it in half, open up a little opening in the middle so that we can take that ribbon and we can insert it in the middle. So okay. I'm just gonna Open up the seam Just a little bit. Just trying to guesstimate. Nobody cares. Yeah. There's not anybody not that's coming to your house with a measuring tape and that's say, right. did you get this right here in the middle? Right. Because if they did, I'm going to tell them. You can just go home. Nobody's <laughs> perfect but Jesus. That's right. Nobody's I'm going to your perfect. house and I'm going to measure your pillows. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody has to be perfect. Um but Stick. you want to guesstimate, and you, you need yeah. to just, once you get a hole big enough to get your scissors in there, just run along that seam, yeah. and it'll pop it right off. Okay, so we've got a little hole. All right. Now, okay, we're just going to... Especially fabric scissors. Oh, it's still not doing it right. Oh, well, no, no. We've still got a loose connection in there somewhere. I'm not checking, you know what? It's over here. It's not showing red. Oh, now that I've unplugged it. Hold on. Sorry, y'all. <clears throat> Momentary technical Here, difficulties. Look at the girl. Look at what she's doing while she's doing it. Yeah, can there you see go. me? <laughs> Could you see my hands? I'm so sorry. Up close, and, up close encounter with my hands here. <laughs> okay, so I'm just continuing to open up this a center section. Is it red down there now? Yes, it is. All right. So we are charging properly now. <laughs> yeah, we're doing it. Can y'all see what I'm doing here? I see what you're doing there. Okay. So I Okay, so up. you're going to do it on the other side quickly because yep. we're running out of time. Okay. And fold it in half. We'll do a little center section. Okay. Okay, so never before have I done pillows. Pamela, have you done pillows? Not for decorating for Christmas. I, this is all new to me. I love to decorate a Christmas tree. Once I get that done, I collect Santa Clauses. My Santa Clauses go all over everywhere, and that's my extent. So, it's going to look like a cottage at a light festival or something by the time we get through with this. Sorry, y'all. I'm having so, trouble finding my stitch. I don't have the best eyes here. We could get you some more. That'd help. I know. Would you like to get me some? <laughs> I need some new eyes, y'all. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> oh, come on. And I don't want to.
catch this silky fabric because if I do, it's gonna tear. Uh, you want some help? I'm gonna let Mom do that. <laughs> <laughs> because I don't wanna tear it. My highs have cost us so much money, they better work good. So, I don't know, I think in another video we told you all about um, the new um, glue sticks for fabric. They're fabric sticks, y'all, they're fabulous. Can you see that? Oh, just dropping them out the end there. Um, and that's what we're gonna use on this. And so you wanna get a glue gun, and they're just get a cheap one, y'all. Um, they don't cost very much. Mark it, like we did. Fabric sticks only, glue, I mean, glue everywhere. Um, so that you use only the fabric sticks in it. You can get a little glue gun for next to okay. at Walmart. Now we okay. did try um, the other glue, glue uh, fabric fusion was what it was yeah, called. Yeah, it came in a little bottle. We were not a fan. It does not work good. No. Um, it needs to be still for four or five yes. hours, and we don't have that luxury of being and still. And even then, it long. doesn't work very good. But we went and got the glue, the fabric glue sticks. Used, got a little cheap glue gun. And this stuff works fabulous, y'all. It works really good. So. so I folded the ribbon down, hooked it on to the red part, glued it, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to finish this up by gluing along the outside line. Now, this glue is, at first I thought it's just too watery. Yeah. But once you pull it, and then just kind of it seals Rub right it up. along. It's going to seal it really well. Yeah. I had not ever used fabric glue. No. I don't know about y'all if you've used the hot glue fabric glue. Yeah. But it's really good. Um, it works fantastic. We were very happy with it. Yeah. So It is more watery than the regular glue sticks, but um, it works really good. Yeah. Yeah. Um, as long oh, as I didn't you... Get, I didn't get that one done. I did it. Oh, sh see how fast she is? See, she tries to have me do this too, but I'm way too slow. <laughs> I'm really slow. <laughs> That's okay. That's all right. Normally we're not in a hurry, but we got a lot of time here. So, okay. and we're gonna just glue it back. But do make sure you get a glue gun and you mark it and use only the fabric um, sticks in that glue gun. Dedicate it just to that. Yeah. You can't go back and forth. I guess if you did, you just wouldn't get a good mix. You yeah. get a good mix of nastiness. Yeah. So who wants that? Okay. There we go. So I'm gonna put a little line in the cur in the bend. Stick it in the hole. Stick it in the hole. Yep. So you got your ribbon glued. Now we're gonna glue the bottom part. And glue the little hole shut. Yes. Out and it burns just like the regular. Just like the regular stuff. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now we're going to cut this off a little bit more than we want. Just a little bit. Give yourself a little bit. Um, so we have this hole ribbon. open that we will also, once we get our pillow in, mm -hmm. then we're going to just glue the whole thing right. closed. What Got a neat it? No sew. No sew. Yeah. Yeah. So. Okay. Through the magic. Through the magic of the, of the camera. Ta -da. <laughs> So we have it stuffed, and we just have it pinned, but you would, we would glue it. Here we go. Okay. And now we thought, how cute to make it look like a wrapped present. So, we're going to... We're going to tie that so just that like it... Just like look, it looks like the back of a present. Yeah. So it looks like, you know how when you take it around a present and then I'll the, scoot right this the way. back Thank side you. of it? Yeah. i give her a little bit of room. I can't be a hog. I take okay. up a lot of rain. Well, so do I. So, so you know how when you crisscross your ribbon around the present, it always looks kind of like that in the middle of it. Yeah. Okay. So we are choosing colors that match in here. Yes. We have a white, red, and several different colors of green. Now, are you going to use this to go around your, your uh, messy bow? Yes, I will. So I won't tie this in a total knot, right? You know what? Go ahead and okay. do it, and I will use another one. Well, just 
may have enough length to it. I think I want to just do it easy. Okay. I want to be stress free. I don't That's want right. to have to deal with it. and easy. So stress we just tied it like that in a little knot so it looks like the back of your presents when you wrap them. Okay, but then we're going to put a messy bow together. And we're just doing lots because I want a mm -hmm. fluffy. Yes. Fluffy, fluffy. And I'm going to throw in a little bit of glitter Lots to glam it up a little bit yes. and to make my buddy over here happy. Mm -hmm. yep. A little glitter. And you can use, the nice thing about a messy bow, you can even use these really skinny ones for that. It's maybe you thought, oh, what am I going to do with those? See all those little extra pieces that you had left over? Save them because yeah. they're great for a messy bow. They are really great. Yep. And then you don't waste any of that stuff. And you do want a little bit of this the, curly looking uh -huh. stuff at the end. Because it looks great in the messy bow, yes, especially on, on the very top. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Looks really so good. I'm going to use this one left over and we're going to mm -hmm. slip a ribbon underneath it and we're going to tie that. Okay. Do you need my finger? I think I can do without your finger this She's time. She's so talented. She doesn't no. even need my finger. Oh, no, no, no. Let's don't go there. Because you'll jinx me. No. <laughs> if there was a such thing as jinx. No, there's no such thing. So, okay. I don't believe in that. We All don't right. believe in that. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to do really tight because the tighter yes. we do, the better it is. The fluffier it is, yes. too. And we still have this that we can use on the bottom. Right. So, go around now. Around. I think, think that. that's too big. What do you think? Yeah. So we're going to remember to make it bigger it. and then you can trim it up. Yes. Yeah, so we can always make it bigger by yes. it smaller. But we can't make it bigger. That's right. So we're just going to. And normally I go in and dovetail everything, but that's not going to happen today. And there's so many of them, I don't think it will mind. Yeah. I don't think it's going to matter. Okay. That's cute. So. We're going to tie that right there. Can mm -hmm. you tie that with what you had left over while we go? Yeah, I sure can. And you don't even have to tie it pretty. You can just put it in a little knot. And the strings will just go in with yep. the rest it of it. flow in with the rest yeah. of it. Look at that, y'all. Isn't that cute? So there you go. There's something that you can put on you your... You can have a pretty other side. That's right. So if anybody sits on it, it's soft. That's right. It's not got any And it wires. won't hurt your ribbon either. Won't hurt your ribbon, won't no. hurt your ribs. That's right. No ribs, Isn't no that ribbons. Cute? What do you think? Do you like it? Do you love it? Do you want to make one just like That's right. it? We sure appreciate it. Now, if y'all like our crafts and you don't want to miss anything we do, don't go up to the front, hit follow, and we will notify yep. you every time we're on. If you're on YouTube, mm -hmm. hit that subscribe button and yep. that bell, and that'll tell you when and we're Instagram. here, too. We're on Instagram. And Twitter. We're on Twitter. <laughs> you can't throw a dead cat and not hit us. <laughs> we're right. everywhere now. Don't forget to sprinkle with your friends and family. Yes, please do. Yes. If you're watching this on the replay, hashtag replay and yes. let us know you were watching yes. us. That just means so much for us yeah. to know that. If you think of any great ideas that we haven't done that you'd like for us to try, Tell us that too, because we'll try it. Go in the comments. Yeah. Put any comments that you want. Yeah. We do read them. If you have any questions, yes. let us know. We'll be glad to help you out. Yep. All right. Till next time, remember, love one another. Love one another. Bye. Thank you. Bye.